What you see before you are three drops of food dye in corn syrup. As the glass inside is rotated, the three drops of food dye seemingly mix. However, when we rotate it back in the other direction, the process can be reversed almost perfectly because of a phenomenon called laminar flow. Fluid motion can be characterized by the type of flow undergone by the fluid in a channel. The type of flow that the fluid undergoes depends on the Reynolds number of the fluid in that system. The Reynolds number is a quantity that is defined as the ratio of the inertial forces to the viscous forces of the fluid. The lower the Reynolds number, the more likely the fluid is to undergo laminar flow. When fluid motion is described as laminar flow, it, it is characterized by smooth and orderly flow of the fluid. The rate of diffusion is very low due to its high viscosity, hence there is no lateral mixing between layers of the fluid. The wider glass contains corn syrup which has a high viscosity. Three different colors of food dye have been thoroughly mixed with corn syrup and then added to the wider glass. This is to achieve the same viscosity as the corn syrup, yet sh to show the contrast. Due to the low Reynolds number, the corn syrup goes through laminar flow when the inner glass is rotated. As such, even though the food dyes appear to mix together, due to the laminar flow, they do not actually mix, and hence when the inner glass is rotated backwards, the process can, re can be reversed almost perfectly.